In this video, we will try to solve a problem on Lefer Kuru that was asked by a friend on WhatsApp. The question is like this. Let the Lefer Kuru for an economy is given by that is R is equal to 50T minus 2T square where R is the revenue in millions of pounds. T is the tax rate. We have to find the tax rate that maximizes tax revenue. Okay. So, uh, what is actually a Lefer Kuru? A Lefer Kuru uh, is... Uh, actually, it shows us the relationship between the tax rate and the tax revenue collected by the government. And it looks like this. Let's draw it here. It looks like this. We have tax rate on horizontal axis. And we have tax revenue. Let's write here. Uh, tax revenue on vertical axis. Okay. And what actually it says, it says this as tax rate increases, the government's tax revenue also increases. But there comes a point, uh, there comes a tax rate. Uh, if we try to increase uh, the tax rate beyond this very uh, beyond that point, uh, our tax revenue will decrease. Okay, so that point would be the ex, uh, optimum uh, rate of tax which will maximize the government's revenue and going beyond that very point will have uh, will actually decrease the government's uh, tax revenue okay so we will see what is the question question is uh, r subscript t is the government revenue is a function of that is is a function of tax okay so 2t square this is our uh, tax revenue function okay now now that tax rate that maximizes the tax revenue is given by so actually what we have to find we have to find the value of the value of this very point that is we have to find the slope of this very point here okay so tax uh, revenue will be maximized when the slope of this uh, tax revenue function will be zero that means actually uh, at optimum our uh, slope is zero okay so i will write here at uh, the tax rate uh, the tax rate that maximizes the tax revenue will be given by that is given by uh, d or t our dt is equal to zero that means if this is our tax rate then the tax uh, rate that maximizes our tax revenue will be given when the slope of this very line is equal to zero what is the slope of this line the slope that means at this point uh, the slope of this line would be zero that means we have to differentiate our revenue function and set it equal to zero with respect to tax okay now if we differentiate so the derivative of a t is one so we are left with 50 minus derivative of t square is uh, uh, 2t so this becomes uh, 2 into 2 becomes 4t 4t and we set it equal to zero or 4t is equal to if we transpose these so this comes out to be 50 or t is equal to 50 over 4 which comes out to be uh, 4 ones are 4 then we have this becomes 10 4 twos are 8 and then 2 are left so this becomes 20 so 4 fives are 20 that means tax rate of 12.5 uh, percent is the tax rate that maximizes the tax revenue of the government and if we uh, try to increase the tax rate beyond this very point let us say this is here 12.5 if we increase the tax rate let us say to 13 let us say 13 then our tax revenue will decrease and we can see here also uh, for that let me so i will uh, show here let us say we have a tax rate of 12 first so if we have tax rate of 12 let us say t is equal to 12 what would be our total revenue total revenue would be equal to 50 
into 12 minus 2 into 12 into 12 is t square is 144 when we solve this will come out to be 312 okay now when let us say here we have 312 million dollars okay now when tax rate is when t is equal to 12.5 our tax revenue would be equal to uh, 50 into 12.5 minus 2 into 12.5 into 12.5 comes out to be i have calculated it it comes out to be 156.5 156.5 and it uh, comes out to be 312.5 million okay now when this is at this point we have 300 uh, 312.5 million when the tax rate is 12 when the tax rate is let us say 12 we have 312 and when the tax rate is 13 uh, when tax rate is 13 when t is equal to 13 t is equal to 13 our revenue would be equal to if we plug t is equal to 13 in here it will come again uh, 12 sorry our total revenue will come out to be 312 okay so it will uh, start diminishing when tax rate is 12 so we will get a revenue a is equal to 312 so the tax rate that maximizes the tax revenue for the government will be 12.5 okay and it's obvious uh, if we try to increase the tax uh, continuously so the tax revenue will start to diminish okay it's simply uh, the high tax rate discourages uh, the tax rate activities so why would someone mm, like to work if the tax rate is 100 percent at their time if tax rate is 100 percent the tax revenue for the government will will probably be zero because uh, nothing will be left for the employer who has earned his salary and if uh, he has to pay 100 percent of the tax he, uh, he is left with zero and he will say why should i even work when all uh, the salary goes to the government and i am left with zero salary okay so uh, we can say high tax uh, discourages tax activities and low taxes have the effect is that it fails to generate sufficient uh, tax um, sufficient revenue for the government okay so this